What is going on, everybody? RZZ here, back in the video here today. We're going to be watching the X Files season three finale. It is here, it is time. I'm really excited to see how this season is going to end. Um, I'm really, really curious to how it will be. Um, last episode was intense. That amazing Mortar and Scully moment, man. I'm excited to see how their relationship changes, how they handle like the moment after, like the episode after that happened. Uh, it's going to be crazy. I'm really, really excited and intrigued to see where the relationship goes, where their friendship grows, like how it grows. And um, Skinner, I want to see more Skinner. I want to see them connect. I want to see them really put forth a really big effort to try and stop cancer, man. Like, bro, the dude is annoying, bro. He is annoying. Um, I'm just excited to see what happens, man. But um, this, available, this episode will be available on Patreon soon after i am uploading every single one starting from season one episode one to here um season four will take a while to come out because uh, i'm gonna try and put everything on patreon and season four um uh, up until like episode seven or eight will be available on patreon before it gets to youtube um just so i can watch other shows and i'm gonna take a, like a few week break from the x-files um so yeah be ready for that and you guys can go over to patreon subscribe over there and uh if you want and uh yeah but thank you guys for all the support on the next files man I really appreciate it I really just appreciate you guys so much um uh i will come youtube come back to youtube really quickly um but i really want to hit 700 subscribers on here so if you guys can help me out with that um it would mean a lot honestly um yeah, but thank you guys so much for all the support, and uh, let's get right into the episode. There we go. Arlington, Virginia. Yeah. Uh, no, don't think you're not expendable. No. He never once said I was doing a good job. All my hard work. No, this guy. Nobody wrong with ever him. stuck up for me. And nobody moves. Oh, no. Everybody stays. Oh, shut up. I said shut up. Now listen oh, to me, God. everyone, listen to me. Okay, the children can go. Everybody else, nobody moves. We need the police, you quick. Oh, shoot, what's this dude doing? Please don't harm anyone. Get away, I'll shoot. You're frightening these people. I'll do it. Hey, I will do it. They've done nothing to you. Oh, you don't know. I am not a loser. No, you're not. Watch well, him shoot the wrong person. No! Oh! Oh! What does he mean? What the hell? What the heck? This is wild. Bro, what the heck? Where are the wounded? What? I'm FBI. Where are the people who were shot? Everybody's inside. We aren't going to find any wounded. You were shot? Right here. Right in the stomach. I felt the bullet answer me. And the next thing I remember was, was being on the floor. My legs and arms were numb, and, and I could taste blood in my throat. Then I see the man's face. What man? It was the same guy who tried to talk the gun guy out of hurting anyone. What did he do? He touched me. And he said I was gonna be okay. And then all of a sudden, I could feel my legs and arms again. Truly wild. Yo, imagine like something happens and this everybody just starts falling dead. The people that got shot, imagine they just start dying. Did you talk to him? Who? The shooter described a man, a man who reached down and healed him with the palm of his hand. He's gone. They let him leave the scene? Well, nobody let him leave. He was in custody, and they were talking to him, and then somehow he just disappeared. Wow. Without a trace. Oh. 
Lordy's mom. That is Mortar's mom, right? I, I, I'm pretty sure it is. But I always forget to look. Shoot. Why is she there alone like that, though? Why is she just... I guess she probably wants to see the house. That is their house, right? I don't know, man. But that's sus that these doors would be open. She shouldn't even be there. Whoa. What the heck? What? what? Oh, my God, bro. Everything changes but the sea. Does she know him? What do you want from me? Uh, I thought we might at least allow ourselves to reminisce. Bro. Don't tell me she slept with him or something, bro. Wow. Oh my god, they slept together. They had an affair. Wow. That is definitely Mulder's mom, man. Oh my God, bro. What is going on? I look down on my notebook to write something. I look up. The guy's not standing there anymore. It was like he just disappeared. Thank you. Mulder. Agent Mulder, this is Assistant Director Skinner's office. Would you please hold for him? Yeah. Agent Mulder. Uh-huh. I just received a call here that might cause you some alarm. What is it? Your mother's just been admitted to a hospital in What the heck? In a small coastal town in Rhode Island called uh, Quono... Quonacatog? I'm on my way. What the heck happened to his mom? She was just okay. What the heck? How's she in the hospital? Bro, he did this to her, man. The cancer man, bro, did this, bro. Oh, my gosh. The nurse said she had a stroke. They don't yet know the nature or severity of it. But the doctor's on his way down. She's cold. Mulder, I don't want to jump to conclusions. I don't want you to think the worst. People recover from these situations all of the time. Bro, he can't lose his mom, bro. Mm -hmm. She hasn't been able to speak. She's been in and out of consciousness. How did she get here? A 911 call came in. The paramedics from Shelter Harbor found her on the floor of the house. Oh, she's awake. It's okay. Everything's gonna be okay. Hopefully she can tell him something, what though. It? What do you want? I think she wants something to write on. Palm. That means something to Mortar, I'm guessing? Wait, the cigarettes? Wait. I don't know, man. I'm just thinking stuff. I'm pretty sure there's cigarettes that are called palm something, palm something. I don't know, man. I'm trying to think of the ones that he smokes. Can't you, man? He's always smoking. Man, bro, what did he do to her? They were arguing. She could, it could have caused a stroke, but I don't know, man. You okay? No. Yeah. I'm, um... I just can't help thinking there's a correlation. Correlation? A connection to the shootings at the fast food restaurant. I'm sorry, I, I don't understand. My mother wrote the word palm. And that's what the man who healed the victims, that's what he used, the palm of his oh, hand. Oh, I guess. I was you, anything you think about that. Sleep? Mulder, there's no deep mystery here. The, your mother is at a, the right age for something like this to happen. Yeah, but why the word palm? Well, there could be several reasons. But to be honest, I don't think it means anything. Her her brain and her thought processes have been... have been radically changed by what's happened. That must be him. Well, what, what the heck? Yeah, he's gone. Where did he go? Bro, there he is. Can nobody see him? 
Wait, they can't see him or something, bro? He's literally the only one walking. Thank you. Got him. But he's here. This dude is always so much further ahead, bro. How? How is he always, always ahead? Holy crap. They got him like this? Bro, what the heck? Huh? Bro. Oh, my God. This dude. He was here with her. What? With your mother. The cancer man. Okay. What are you talking about? Maybe oh, I can bring you up to speed, Agent Mulder. But wait. He, I don't trust him anymore, though. So he must have been taking the pictures. But I don't trust him, though. Did you take these? They had quite an argument. As you might gather from the snapshots. You seem surprised. And surely you were aware they knew each other. Or what brought them here together? I don't know. Did he hurt her? No. No, she collapsed after he left. I dare say if I hadn't been here to make the call, she might not have survived. Hmm. So should we be thanking him or should we still be sus about him? He wants something from her. Something she may have kept in this house. Unless you know another reason they would have chosen to meet here. The day my parents divorced, my mother vowed never to set foot in the summer house again. Well, they were divorced? No, my mother. She kept her word. It could be something very old. Certainly something very important. I have no idea what that could be. Sure, what I've done wrong. You haven't done anything wrong, sir. May I go? Yes. But until this matter is resolved completely, I'd ask that you notify us if you'll be out of town for any reason. I don't know, man. Because they did something to him, so... Uh... Agent Scully? I don't like that. It's so dark, man. There's no lights in here? Turn the lights on. Thank you. Lamp? Okay. Maybe it's inside the lamp? You're not allowed the luxury of human weakness and penitence. You're not allowed to put your indulgences ahead of the greater purpose. I no longer believe in the greater purpose. Then your fate is just. My justice is not for you to mete out. You may have reason. You have no right. You have no means either. You presume to dictate duty to me? Have you any idea what the cost of your actions is? What their effect might be. Who are you to give them hope? Mm. What do you give them? We give them happiness. Facts. No, no you don't give, give them nothing, authority. bro. The authority to take away their freedom under the guise of democracy. Men can never be free. Because they're weak, corrupt, worthless. What the hell? At what cost to them for your own selfish yeah, benefit? Yeah, bro, I miss him, bro. How many must die at your hand to preserve him. your stake in the project? Even he's freaked out. <laughs> Hold his calls. I want his name. I want to know everything about him. Excuse me? I want the smoking man smoked out. I want him exposed to be the murdering son of a bitch that he is. What's your problem, Mulder? Where have you been? 
at our summer house. He was there with my mother. He's the reason for what happened to her. Where did you get these? It doesn't matter where I got those. The only oh. thing that matters is that that man is called to answer. Now, I want his name. I don't know his name. You know how to get it. These men don't have names. Well, then you tell me how to find him. Agent Mulder, there was a time when I might have been able to tell you how to contact him, but that time has passed. He knows about the man that disappeared from the restaurant shooting. What are you talking about? He's trying to kill him. Mulder, he just came in yesterday. He turned no. himself in. What? It's not the same he, guy. He gave a statement. Crap. Where is he now? He works for the Social Security Administration. Can you tell me where you're taking me? Well, plenty of time to talk, sir. The heck? Whoa, see, you still. Conscience, you kill them. But you that? can't kill them all. You can't kill their love, which is what makes them who they are. Makes them better than us. Better than you. You talk. I'm not one of you. No. All you want is to be a part of it. Mm. It's to be one of the commandants when the process begins. But you are wrong. Oh. Am I? Yes. You are dying of lung cancer. Oh, he is? It's a lie. Love to see it. I think it's a lie. Save your life. And you. What the heck? Um, I forget what this dude did. What did he do? Oh, it was him. He did. I forgot about him, man. He was a dude that had that. Bro. Oh my God. Oh, where'd he go? We had been hopeful, but there was substantial blood loss during the stroke event. Bro, we cannot let, bro, he can't lose his mom, bro. Bro, this is devastating, bro. He just lost his dad, too, man. Come on. Him and Scully having so much loss, man. Oh man, I hate this from older man. He doesn't deserve this. Oh my god, bro. You gonna smoke that? Or you wanna smoke on this? Are you giving me a choice? Thank you. I should Take shoot you me. right here, but they'd probably be able to save you. Do it. Do it, Agent Mulder. Or maybe put a bullet through your brain so you'll be bedridden for the rest of your life. Like that. Hush. What do you care? I've known your mother since before you were born, Fox. I don't care. I'd gone to see her recently. Yeah. And I know what you were looking for. I wasn't looking for anything. That's what she was looking for, actually. She contacted me. You liar! I had information, possibly. On the whereabouts of your sister. That's Cap. He said that he, he needed her to remember something. Do you have it? Do you have it? Yes. Give it to me. I can't do that. It's of no value to you. And to you? When the time comes, no. when the truth is finally determined, its value will soar. Why? I think you know why, Agent Mulder. Let me get clear on something here. What we're talking about is colonization. The data's set, isn't it? Give me the weapon, Agent Mulder. No. Oh! Yeah, bro, we can't trust him. Bro. Yeah, no way, we can trust him. Oh, 
Ooh. You shoot me, and you'll never find it. I ought to shoot you anyway. After everything I've given you. What are you giving him, though? I'm walking Lies. away. You're a dead man, Agent Mulder. One way or the other. Who is it? Jeremiah Smith. What the heck? Please let me in. Take your gun out. Come on, Scotty. Let's go. Keep your hands up, please. I have important information for you, something your partner has been seeking. It concerns an elaborate plan, a project, and his sister. Why didn't you tell me before? I've never spoken to you before. The man you spoke to was an imposter. He was sent here to kill me. Oh. Who right. are you? I'll explain everything. Of course a phone call comes in, bro. Of course. Yeah. Scully, it's me. Mulder, where are you? I've been up with my mother. Listen to me. Mulder, listen to me. There's somebody here. Somebody you need to talk to. Who? Jeremiah Smith. All right, Scully, you got to get out of your apartment. They're going to be looking for him. I want you to meet me. Where? Off the I-95, uh, Bond Mill Road. Scully, move away from him. Come stand behind me. I've come to you at great risk. I mean you no harm. I have a long and complicated story to tell you. Mulder, he knows about your sister. How do I know you're for real? I was at that restaurant. I healed those people. Yes, but how? I can explain everything to you. First, I want you Don't to come Don't tell me he healed me. the cancer man, dude, bro. Don't I want you to come with that. me to see my mother. Oh, my God, bro. Fuck is this? Is this Skinner? Tell me it's Skinner. Oh, brother. He's here to kill me. This is not good. Don't. To be continued, bro. Of course. Of course. Of course, man. Of course. That was an electric episode right there. That was a frustrating, heartbreaking, annoying episode right there, man. I can't believe we get to, to be continued. Um,. That was a crazy ending right there, man, because it's about to be a face-off, a true face-off, standoff. I don't know what's going to happen. I don't know what's going to happen, but that was a good episode. I need Mortar's mom to be okay. She needs to be okay. He cannot lose his mom and dad, bro. No way. Um, this is crazy, man. Cancer man is annoying, man. This dude is always ahead we need to get him take him down bro imagine if he's actually on the good side imagine that no way though. i don't believe it i would never believe that um this is crazy though craziness um yeah man it's about to be wild i gotta watch the next episode i gotta watch season four man i gotta watch it because that ending is just not okay with me right now um thank you guys for all the support that's coming up the video if you enjoyed please leave a like comment down below subscribe go to subscribe to the patreon you guys will get the episodes first um and i'll start posting those probably in a few days um but link will be down in the description below thank you guys for all the support make sure you guys leave a like comment subscribe and uh it's been your brother i'll see you guys in season four peace